I come to to me. I told you though the time last time we was here that God was doing something for this baby. I need the old I need it. every hour I need it. oh bless me now my
to delete in, take it and put it on your head. The cover, you know, the cover that to delete, just put it on your head. My God. Oh my God. Put that down. Put it there. And watch that. Look at that. 
old head. The thing about the head is about the power of God. He's a good God, ain't he? And all power is in Jesus' name. I want to be like this little baby. Eight years old and two months older. But I will still want to be a baby. In the Lord. Say, Lord, use me. Like you want to use me. I never thought about that, that, that cover of the Talib like that, the daughter Betty. That's pretty good. I thought she would put the whole big family on her head. She would have kept a cover on her head. God is a good God. If you know who lives in you. Can I talk about it just a little bit? I want y'all to introduce who lives in you. If you would open up the door and let it come in. You want to live in us. Because our home is not here on earth. We are citizens of heaven. And it's time to prepare where you want to be. I'm living here and they want to treat me all kinds of ways. He said I was among them and that he must know who I was. But I, I want to let you know I don't belong here. I've been knowing that for a long time and I was treated as old and all the sickness and troubles and things that happened in Jupiter. Oh, I knew I don't belong here. I just look at this city of the Lord and can't bother and can't deal with me. I know that I, I can't yeah. be living with God. Yeah. But he let us know if I'm fire, who can be a fish? We are more than conquerors in Christ. Jesus is stepping us. I'm somebody in the Lord. I refuse to go out even in this year step over to 2020 because you're going to find some hell things in 2020. So you better know who lives in you. I've been predestined. I've been chosen. Have you been chosen? Have you been chosen? Do you know this? Chosen. The best you've been chosen. Huh? If you know you've been chosen, then then we ought to amen. Lift your hand to the hill. From where our help comes from. Our help comes from the Lord. Oh, I feel like I think it's crazy in this place today. Woo! Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. For being so good to us. This is going to get some word for it. The Bible says in the teachers the first chapter, verse number four, that he knew us before the world began. Can you take the time to get some for you? Yes, right. Yes, right. I want to take a hand because yeah, I want to show you something in a moment. It ain't about that old hat. That boy been around for a while. <laughs> that it let us know if God is in us, why are we getting so restless? I don't belong to me. I belong to Jesus, my Lord and Savior. He is God who I can back to God to be. When he come in, the old things walk out. New things coming in. She's coming in. Something other kind of thing. Something is coming in. You ought to say, Jesus, I invite you to come in me. You ought to tell him, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Anyhow. Oh, I believe you're going to have some church in a minute. I am the church. You said, I promise this rock, I'll build my church in the gates of hell. So, oh, I feel. Woo! Yes, 
you to get up. My God, it'll mess you up. But he took dust. And he stepped into dust. Y'all can come on here. That means I call us dust enough, but I'm here with dust bag. We have a dust bag. We have a dust bag. Read to us in 17. It, it didn't say dust. The breath of life. And man became a living soul. Then God get into you. Man got to move out. Man. God get into you. The woman got to move out. Wow. Now the Bible tell me that the name was Adam. Her name was Adam. His name was Adam. But before she, when she came out and they got to, God didn't give her the name Eve. But when she was in Adam, her name was Adam. <laughs> the ways of a woman is not known. She come out of him and he don't know her way. All oh, these men, a pastor, we don't know the ways of the wise. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you good God. But I want to let you know now, I think you hear now, you were just standing there before God came in. You didn't have no mind, no spirit, no power, no knowledge, no will, no blood, but there, no breathing. There was nothing there but this dryness. But when God came in, you got it. Here the Bible tells us, amen, in the book of Ephesians, the first chapter, verse 4. Now he had already come down and stepped into the dust, and he became a living soul. But watch what he said in the New Testament, in the book of Ephesians, the first chapter, verse 4. And according as he had chosen us in mm. him before mm. the foundation of the world, mm. that we should be holy and without blame well. before him in love. My God, thank you, baby. You should sure have wait the second time it done fell on her. Yes, you have, Apostle. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to see if they're paying attention. So we about to feel something here today. Thank you, baby. And I'm trying to tell her, but she's down and she's going to hold my hand. Man. I don't know you, baby. Because if, if God ever hold your hand, oh, you've got to my God. I know that right. God hand is your hand. Yes, sir. Well, God is a powerful God. And when he hold your hand, can nothing shut your hand. Can nothing do nothing. Oh, you want to tell him yes, Lord. Come 
get that in this. Come here and sit right there. I didn't tell you to do anything else but sit right there. And you say your obedience is better than sacrifice. I told you to sit there. The joy of the Lord is my strength. He said, you will order my footsteps and you'll give my head for the joy of the All I got to do is just sit there and be submissive. But the Bible said, I'm going to sit back y'all and see if you want me. I knew them before the world began. Everything they need, I gave it to them before I sent them. Let me stop a minute. He said, Moses, go and tell Pharaoh to let my people go. That's right. And here he done disobeyed God, trying to get an interpreter. To tell the crew what God had told him to tell the crew. God said, I said, go and tell Pharaoh to let my he reached down and got two pebbles. We were talking, go, 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 He put those pebbles in his mouth. Yes, Lord, I'll go to Pharaoh and tell him what you say. Yeah. All right. When God tells you something, you don't make a mistake. That's right. That's right. So I heard him say, no. I know you before the world began. Mm -hmm. Ephesians first chapter verse four. Remember what I read? It's Ephesians one, uh, one, one and verse four. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we know what I'm saying. <laughs> so I already know about you. When I said you, I have already equipped you. Why would he send you to church and you don't have a mind to receive what God said? Why would he tell you to get up and you can't dress yourself? Why would he tell you, praise God, amen, to pray and you ignore the prayers? If I'm for you, who can be against you? So I know what about you. Now, since I am messed up in the garden, in this society, and see, it's already been set up that Satan claimed that he know everything in the word. So I'm going to send you down there where he just obeyed me in heaven. He came in the garden and disobeyed me. In the book of Genesis 1 and 1, there was a flood. Yes, the first major flood was during the time of the disobedience of Satan that God has sent him down to the earth to bless the vegetation of the earth. Instead of doing that, he began to do other things. And God flooded the earth. I'm about to let you go. I feel crazy now. See, now I want to see what they are doing. Look at us now. I knew you before the world began. Now, I want you to go over there and tell daughter Betty if I'm, I'm more than the world against her. Go. Go. Still go ahead and tell me daughter Betty what I say. She tells me better what she wants to say. And the Bible says in Roman 10, verse number 14, how can you hear me about the and how can he preach unless he does shit? How can anybody be to those that lift that hand up a minute because I believe he's gonna use that hand. He took he took a, 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 a piece of stick, made eyes look, hmm. and numbers he uh oh he echo, he echo, I got to say it because he didn't say no mute, he said ass. And he told the master, bid him ride on him, that was ain't just standing in the game. Yeah. So y'all got the recording for me. <laughs> so here I sent you because I want to see would you be blameless. 
We do it everything but what God got told us to do. So if I can still show me the Holy Spirit. And excuse me, the Holy Spirit is God. Where do I? Where do I? Where do I? Go to John 1 and 1. Can I teach you just a little bit? Is it your Bible too? Is that mine? I got old time Bible. I take back that long up in the prayer room. I got Bibles. Just, oh, Bibles. Oh, oh, because I want to see what they're saying in each one of the words. I ought to be saying the same thing. Should be no different. One God, one faith, one baptism. So, 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 what did he say? In the beginning was the Word, uh -huh. and the Word was with God, uh -huh. and the Word was God. And the Word was God. God. So who came to see about it is God. For God so loved the Word, John three sixteen. For God so loved the Word, He gave His only begotten Son. And when we went back, oh, can I go a little bit? You got time, so I let's go back into Luke two and verse number twenty one. Uh, his name was who? Jesus. But he was already in heaven, preparing him, amen, to come down. But when he came down, then they added Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. So it was God who came down. I told you to go and pray. Instead of you praying, you pray. I told you to lift up my name. Yeah. Instead of you lifting up my name, you lift up your name. Right. But then I say, have no other God before me because I am a just God. Yeah. So the Bible said now, Chosen. Look, look at my brother over there. If he'd been chosen, who can stop him? If he fire, who can? If I shut a door, who can open it? If I open up a door, who can shut it? I'm fighting out for you on the earth. You say we just like sheep going to a slaughter. Like every day we want to be slaughtered. But he said, I was among them, and they didn't know who they didn't know about me. Everybody say, this is not, I don't have no citizenship on this earth, on, 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 in, in America. But my citizenship is, my citizenship is, is in heaven. Amen. My citizenship is in heaven. Yes, Hallelujah. Glory, give me one. Thank you, daughter. Give me one heck of chain. My citizenship is in heaven. So I'm here just for a test. Well, yes. Every day we're being tested. Every day. Jesus, the son of the living God, came down to 42 generations. Thank you, daughter. Oh, she's working on it. Working on it. Working on it. Working on it. Some good is about to happen. If Jesus had to be tested, if she wouldn't have to change. She over there fanning a possum. <laughs> I'm the one who ought to be burning up. Jeremiah said, feel this like fire. Shut up. Jesus. I feel crazy in here. Jesus. You're cold. You stop coughing in the house of God. Yes. 
God about to do something for that precious baby. He about to cover you, woman of God. He about to cover you. Yes, he is. You're going to be a testimony for him and tune it like you never heard. You're going to be a testimony. Here's another testimony right there. A test I'm a testimony too. I should have been dead and gone. He told me to shave my head. Counselor don't kill a lot of folks. All kind of folks. I'm still standing, baby. Oh, yeah. Eighty and right. too much over eighty years old. <laughs> In my right mind. Hallelujah. It's on fire! Oh no, my God! I felt something. Jesus. 
verse number 14. What can we do? But it ain't us. It's God in us. Amen. I'm going to show you something. Stand still. I'm going to the light to come. Come to me. Come to me. Come into me. Come to me. Ah. He is a spirit. And we must worship him as spirit. Truth. God is a spirit. John 4, verse 24. Said John. He is a spirit. And we must worship him. The spirit of truth. So he is a spirit. I don't care where I go, the light is going to follow. Look at the light. I want to show you something. I want to show you something. I want to show you something. Don't y'all be looking at a guy named Della. I called over here. I want to show you something. Spirit and truth. Amen. How could your body be here and God is sitting to California and your body ain't moving? How could you be praying for somebody in New York and your body don't move like they can feel the presence of God in the room? Yes. 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 We are spirit. We are spirit beings. He have a body he want to live in. He want to live in somebody. Yeah, yeah. Hey, good God. Yeah. How can that light come over here when the light is right there? He operate. He do the operation. He walk and he talk in us. Somebody say your dust bag. Maybe dust bag from the ground, but I'm a spirit. Yeah, I'm, I'm a temple way God wanna live. God wanna live in this temple. God wanna live in this temple. He wanna live in this temple. So by he being in us and ones. O N E N E S O N. Yeah, that's how you spell it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's how you spell it. <laughs> so by being one, everywhere we move, so uh, come here, Dory Daddy. Well, you should wear that hat. <laughs> well, that's a new style right there. That right there would do something too. If you walk into this summer, if you walk into next year, 2020, and to show you that I don't know your daughter, I haven't seen her, but watch this. Wear you uh, little glasses because I can't buy them glasses. I, got, I go down the Dollar Tree. <laughs> This morning we was coming, I 
and I stopped by the place. The manager run out of her, <laughs> run from the, <laughs> run on the outside, yeah. and sometimes they be going, going, going around the curb, then, and they got me running the business. Yeah. They run out the place. Pray for me. Yeah. <laughs> it's a spirit. Yeah. Yeah. Pastor, yeah. read yeah. John 4, 24. Again, for me, daughter. God is a spirit, and huh? they that worship him must worship him in spirit and in truth. So everywhere I move, the spirit of God moves. That's right. Yeah. Everywhere I move, the spirit of God moves. Open your eyes up. They have the nerve to want to talk about the Spirit of God. They look at us on the outside and forgot about who be up in them. I feel crazy. I feel crazy. You would not go back to chapter. You won't go in 2020, not 2019. Watch it for me. 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 Can't do nothing about it. 
Movie glasses, honey. Sorry. Movie glasses. I don't even want to get up. I'm coming to you. Walk with me. Y'all do walk with me. Now, let me show you something. When I'm doing what God tells me, don't y'all get out of shape now. Because he tells me what to do and who to tell. So don't you bother me. When he tells me, I have to, I'm going to obey. Amen. I speak to your mind. Touch! Get out of there! Get out of there! Get out of there! In Jesus' Now, do this for me. Listen, 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 listen. The dance, the dance. Listen, 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 listen. See, really, you're a woman too, so it's not going to hand me to the man. Grab it with both hands. Father, send me into a kindness down. <laughs> send me into a Turn back no more. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Yes. Pastor, do something for me. Take this to me and put it around my shoulder. Now, I never seen you before, have I? And I didn't even know the sickness or nothing. Nothing wrong with the body, did I? But grab that side of the tree. Grab this one hand, one hand. And let me grab the other hand. Grab this one. Grab this one. And grab that. Can I use your hand again? Did they have to put on the hand again? Oh my God. Look at that. Look at that girl. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. They've got a head on the tree. Bring it, bring it here, bring it here, bring it here. Yo, watch it, watch it, watch it, brother. Both of you, watch it right here. Something happened to a rat now. See what I mean? Look at here. Something happened to a rat now. Look at here. Ain't got no breath in time right there. <laughs> Let me tell you one thing. You're going to see some of the people come in this house. And where you go, you don't have to fret yourself. And whatever God tells us to do, you just be in power when I call you to obey. Touch yourself. I heard it back then. I heard it. I heard it. If you take a deep breath, take a deep breath, honey. Take a deep breath. Cause there you go. Touch. Touch. 
In Jesus' name. Take a deep breath. Take it, take it, take it, take it. Take it and say no more. In Jesus' name. You going to the door and blow it out. Everybody say, Lord, Lord, bless thy people. Bless thy people. In this auditorium. In this auditorium. That obeying. That obeying. The spirit. The spirit. Of God. Of God. Let every. Let every. Strive. Strive. And malice. And malice. Go. Go. Move your hands a minute. Because Holy Ghost is going to get you. Holy Ghost is going to get you. Get you. Lift your hands up. And I ask you to receive. Receive Jesus as your personal Savior. Father God, touch her like a bone. She won't be the same. No more. Touch in Jesus' name. That stupid spirit, that heavy spirit, that mean spirit, go back to hell from where you came from. You will not be that woman no more. You got life and peace. And I slap Jesus. That old heavy spirit, that old mean demon spirit. Pastor, pastor, pastor. It's coming to what you're talking about. Why come in here and don't care if I'm out of here? I don't believe even for your son. Mom, I want to come to chapter. I'm going to give you a number. I don't want you to let me know I'm coming. And then I tell them, they want to come, they come too. But I want to come there. Look at him. You never heard this. Why God touching you, he touching your son. Heal! Holy Spirit, you better do what God say. You're a woman of God. Let me tell you something. Come here, baby. Come here quick. You're a woman of God. Watch it, watch it, watch it, watch it, watch it, watch it. You're a woman of God. You are a woman of God. Let somebody hold it. You're a woman of God. You're a woman of God. You'll never be the same no more. Now pay attention, pay attention, pay attention, pay attention. Pay attention, you will be the same again. Father, even your feet won't walk the same. Your mind won't act the same. The body won't act the same. God did to do something on you that you ain't never Seen in all the days of your life. Touch! Totally gone. <laughs> so I can be totally gone. See, I need some assistance. 
Because y'all finna see something next year, and I need somebody that's gonna be with me on one accord. Amen. And when I start, I'm gonna start calling you somebody, and when I see you doubting like a doubting Thomas, I'm gonna call you out. Well, because the Bible said we are helpers. She was rocking the camera, just got him off the floor. <laughs> baby, yeah. It's my baby. Call you my babies. No funny things, you just my babies. Put my coat around me. Yo, yo, watch your, watch your, watch your, watch your, watch that drunk over there. Watch your, watch your, watch that drunk. Watch your drunk. You can't mess with these drunks. Oh, you ain't seen nothing yet. You better get ready for it. If you don't want to see it, don't come around us. I'm telling Jesus and us. Put the coat on. This is here. Next year gonna be better. Mm. Next year. Next year. Next year. Next year be better. Don't think about this year. Don't think about next year. Don't think about this year right now. That's think right. about next year. Think about 2020. What happened in 2019? It ain't for me no more. But what God could do in 2020, I'll feel it right now. I'm a wrapping up in your word. So get wrapped up in that coat. Say, I'm wrapping up God in your word. And everything the devil thought he took, I'm gaining it back. Twice. Shut the door. You hinder it. This girl finna do something. Finna step over. Finna step over. This girl finna do something in Clinton. Glory, 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 Three drops of say no more. No. No more. No more. Say it again. No more. Say it again. No more. Say it again. No more. No more. No more. No more. <laughs> but you know when the Lord tell me to release them, I got to release them. That's all right. When you tell me to release them, I got to release them. And, and they be crossing something to them. You tell me to release them, I have to release them. You have to shout glory. Glory! <laughs> Been, and look here, she got a camera, would have been 
I'm going to read here. She should be, come here, baby, with your camera. Bring it on over here. Watch it for me. Still keep it on me. Keep it on me. Because I just want to touch you. Keep it on me. 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 Everybody say thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I bet all that hell will come out now. Oh, the meanest thing I could. It's me. Uh -huh. It's me. It's me. I bet you won't be mean no more. I bet you won't be mean no more. God got some work for you. You need to be yourself. Hey, I see you back by the hospital ten years. 
they don't know either. They don't dislike the Lord because I'm telling the truth. And the truth shall be what? So what? I'm saying right to the edge. I know you said it right. Go there and tell the pastor. Be afraid! Be afraid! Be afraid! You feel that? You don't feel no irritation in the stomach. You don't feel nothing in the body.
in the hands of Jesus. Because they justified going in 23. And I heard the Lord. I just shook him to daddy so I could come on the outside. Jesus! I know that before he was born. I know that he was born. Yeah, Sunday, Lord, they can drink. 